Hi guys, welcome to my channel. The Dis Capable Mom here to bring you happiness for your mind, body, and soul. I wanted to give you guys a little introduction. I wanted to tell you some things about myself. My name is Gabon Salabellis, and when I was six years old, I had a brain tumor. The doctors didn't think I would make it, but by God's grace, I slowly progressed and came through. They also told my mom I would never be able to eat, walk, or talk ever again, but by God's grace again, I slowly learned how to eat, walk, and talk. I remember growing up, it was pretty rough for me. I would get bullied and teased by the neighborhood kids and by the school kids and that led to confidence issues. And it wasn't until I got to high school that I started gaining my confidence slightly. Because the kids there, they wasn't teasing me or bullying me. I guess because everyone was entering into adulthood, so we was more understanding and more mature. I remember me asking my mom, if I can go play outside and her reply was what if the neighborhood kids tease you and at that very moment I started to think and realize is this the way I want to live my life caged up in a box hiding from people that may tease me for my disability and I realized that I didn't want that for myself so I gained more confidence from that, realizing that I didn't want that for myself to be caged up in a box. Then, when I got into adulthood, I was still hiding my disability because I would hide my hand and my arm and everything, afraid of what people would think if they knew the truth. Basically, the real me. And I should be happy for the real me. God saved me. And I shouldn't be ashamed of my disability. It wasn't until I got pregnant with my child that I realized my child is going to have to grow up with a disabled mom. My child isn't going to be ashamed of their mom's disability because I'm ashamed. What if my child has kids at his school that tease their mom for their disability? Would I want my child to stick up for me and say, no, that's not right? And what if he has kids at his school that, that tease other kids for having a disability? I want my child to be able to stand up for disabled people and say, no, that's not right. We're not going to do that. So that very moment, I started to realize that I don't want that for myself. I want to be a confident mom. I want to be a good role model to my child. And watch him or her grow up into this wonderful caring person so yeah so that's how I gained my confidence and I'm so glad I gained my confidence because it's led me to venture out to things I never thought I would venture out to and show the world my disability and not be ashamed so I'm so proud of myself and whatever is holding you back just go for it go for it go for it whatever you want go after whatever you want don't let anything hold you back the sky's the limit and God is in the sky. So look towards God for direction and for peace and for humbleness in your life. 
so that's my story thank you for listening as far as my channel I could be cooking up a delicious recipe or giving you fitness advice get to feed your body I could be reciting a spoken word for you the next time to feed your mind I could be just wanting to come on here and talk and to feed your soul and so the sky's the limit thank you so much for listening guys I really appreciate you stay blessed be safe and I'll see you in my next video oh don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you so much okay peace and great love to you. <laughs> Bye.